by just a little bit. Today we anticipate that there will be somewhere between 1,200 and 1,300 seniors here to enjoy the day, to enjoy the music and the other entertainment, the dancing after we have a chance to eat and clear away some of the tables, and of course the ever popular uh, barbecue and meal. We certainly enjoy doing this each year and we can see by the numbers of you that were already here at 8.30 picking out your favorite spot to eat and to enjoy the picnic that you enjoy it as well. So once again we're very glad that you're here and we'd like to uh, we have uh, the rest facilities in the back of the pavilion as well as out in the field over here and also that the medics are here you know, should there be a problem that anyone has. In particular, I'd like to thank Richard Nantz, who is the coordinator of our nutrition programs here at Franklin County Home Care, Val Axton, who is the coordinator of the Home Delivered Meal Program, because they're the two staff people at Franklin County Home Care primarily responsible for putting on this event today. Let's give them a hand. babysitting then for the family or what? No, I, I babysit for some of my friends. They ha they're working and whenever they can't, their regular babysitter is not available, then they call me. I've heard of substitute teachers and now I know a substitute babysitter. Yeah. I think it's That's wonderful. Right. <laughs> All right, Fine. we'll let both of you get on with your food and thank you for taking time to talk to us.
two years is enough for any man down in Washington, you, right? You, I, I, you said so. Your life sounds complicated, though. Your man isn't running. No, I have, I have certain days. And really, uh, uh, tell me a little bit about uh, antiques and collectibles. That's where I really know you from, uh, Sid. Is, uh, are you, uh, antiques and collectibles? Are you still... Uh, I collect. I yeah. collect books. I collect pictorial. I go to your shop a lot, Bob Merriam, and Peter uh, mainly go because along the way I whistle at girls, Woody. I know you. And I eat right, at the yeah. Farron Hospital yeah. to see the nurses. Well, when we get off camera, I thought I could get a few tips for you and then, you know, how to get around with the girls. No, but seriously, is this a political thing? No, you this is not a political thing. This is about this you and your personal life. All right. This, this gentleman right know? here played on the Yale baseball team with George Bush. Is that right? If you look down here, yes. Huh? That's right. And you, you uh, if I remember your story correctly, uh, Sid, you were a pitcher. I was a pitcher. George was a captain and the first baseman. 1948, we went to the College World Series in 47 and 48. Nothing I've done since has been as important as those two years. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> Thanks very much, Sid Rosner, <laughs> here at the Seniors Picnic.
Jackie Trenholm. And Jackie Trenholm. Mm -hmm. well, that's from good. Greenfield. From Greenfield. Right. Greenfield. Yeah. Jackie, is this your first? Or this your... is my first time here. Right, right. Yeah. But oh. we're very active. Well, we're sort of active in our senior center. Uh -huh. Oh, in so Greenfield. That, in Greenfield. Right. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah. No, it's not on High Street. Well, the center isn't actually. It's on Union Street. That's right. right. The entrance is, you're right. So. You're on Entrance Street. See, already I'm wrong. Well, Can you're you cut all, these things out? Yes. You know? We'll, t we'll take all the mistakes and eliminate them. Oh, you can be sure, but we dear. don't guarantee it, right? All right, <laughs> fine. Are you retired? Do you work still? Or? I never did work. I keep saying I'm the only kept woman in Greenfield. Well, that's wonderful. <laughs> I, I just I never did. A, I knew there was a good um, reason why I wanted to interview you, and now I know. <laughs> and I didn't happen to work. It's not that I couldn't have, but I just didn't. No, I, no, I so think that's that you I did don't. work. You had children. Well, you yes. had plenty of work. Very true. Very true. Five children I have, so that was enough. Do you have any grandchildren? I have six grandchildren. Well, that's something four we have. Four boys haven't... and four girls and two boys. Yeah, you almost slipped up there. Yes, I do. Grandma. <laughs> <laughs> I have six, too, but don't oh, ask me the story. All right. <laughs> don't, and don't ask the names, either, huh? <laughs> no. I'll tell you a funny story. One time we were having a contest and, and, uh, at a picnic, not a senior's picnic, and people had to remember their children and their birthdays. Uh -oh. And I had five children, and my children were all there, and I made the horrendous mistake of leaving one of the children out completely. Uh -oh. Isn't that terrible? Yes. That's why I never got the Father of the Year award. I guess so. I was going to say, but just don't forget your marriage date. Oh, That's yeah. all. My husband never could remember the year. <laughs> Knew the day, but never could remember, never remember the, the year. year. Well, so. he was trying to stay young, I guess. All Thanks right. very much for well, talking with us. Well, all righty. Okay. What part of Florida are you living in now? Miles north of Tampa. St. Pete area. Yes, ma'am. Uh, uh, did you uh, come up uh, back up to specifically for the picnic or really to see oh, Wouldn't that be nice to say? Uh, yes, it would. That would be the... <laughs> I came down today specifically for the picnic from Keene, New Hampshire. If that's Is that right? Help. Oh, that's that helps a lot. <laughs> yes, that's right. <laughs> In fact, this, uh, the picnic has fame throughout the region then, right? Yes, I think it's pretty nice. It is nice, right? It's quite a project for somebody to put on. Will you be going back to Florida when then? I didn't get your name, I don't think, but your <laughs> name is, uh, other than you're her sister, but <laughs> we got that. My first name is Rhoda Graves. Mm -hmm. Were you uh, born and raised in Franklin County or in the Keene area? No, I was raised in Franklin County, but I was born in Canada. You were? No, that's all right. Yeah. We'll let you in. from where, ma'am? Greenfield. Are you really? And are you retired or working? Yes, or, yes. I retired four years. Uh -huh. Worked for the telephone company. Wonderful. Oh, I thought uh -huh. those, those soft, dulcet tones. You must have been an <laughs> operator. I was. <laughs> <laughs> is this your first uh, uh, picnic? Or? Yes, it is. Uh -huh. Oh, good. Are you enjoying it, I guess? Yes. Mm -hmm. That's the right answer. We come too late, though. We didn't get a table, so here we are. <laughs> oh, I think, but you're out in the light and it's not well, raining. I think it's wonderful. <laughs>
Let's hear it for Mary Wyatt. She's gonna sing a couple songs for you.
Thank you.